And welcome back guys, welcome back to Sexy Doom where we're doing Project Brutality. Moving on, I also did not show you off something very awesome. You, if you press, well I've set it up as a secondary fire, secondary option, if you press ALT, that is, you have two machine gunners. If you go with the pistol, that's two pistols, right? And let's see, do we have any other options? Okay, wait. A shotgun, we have a slug mode, or we are shot mode, I believe shot was the main thing. Uh, slug mode, again, it's for more enemies in front of you, I believe. We shall try it out, let's move in. So this is a episode 2, I mean, insert in, well, the mission 2 inside this episode 1. So let's see what's gonna happen. I know what's gonna happen, I'm gonna die probably by some unknown factor. There's a massive lag that tends to happen when there's like a gazillion of enemy troops right in front of you, or when you open a motherfucking door for some unknown reason. Well, actually, it's quite an easy reason, understandable, because at the end of the day, when you utilize so many mods, it's all about the engine, if we can handle most of the stuff. You might get a little bit of lag here and there, but that's about it. Also, let's turn on this crap. And also that like should have been now gone and there shouldn't be any problem though. To be honest, I think it's because of the OBS. I'm using OBS because Camtasia doesn't record, so probably it was actually an OBS lag. Uh, it, it was like 20 FPS, 15 FPS. I had to restart the entire damnable thing a few times to get it working. Thank you very much, him. Can you please die? Come on, he's... Oh my god, I lost all? Really? Really? Let me see. Do it. Yeah, it's, it, it's the same thing. Like, oh shit! <laughs> Did you see that? That's why I say this is such an amazing thing. I only lost so much. I believe there is a mancubus. Yep, there it is, right left of us. So it's gonna be a little bit difficult to kill that damnable thing, maybe. Let's try it. Never tried it before. We shall try it now. Holy crap. How? From where are you people coming from? Honestly, like they're just a zillion of these evil things, evil entities of pure awesome. And I can't even kill one. So there are a lot of imps, that's for sure. So let's see what's happening here. Are you dead? He actually is there, so we can definitely do a headshot on Mancubus themselves. However, they're actually called the Fat Bastards. Let's call them Fat Bastards, because that's what they are. There are many Fat Bastards around these locations. I'm being shot by someone. Holy crap, he's taking my health away. Probably a soldier that I can't see. Maybe, yeah, probably. Let's, yep, yeah, there you go. There you go. Please give me a reason, a knowledge on where you truly are. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. I must say, it's not an easy... Oh, my God, I'm gonna die. Oh, these shotgunners. Shotgunners are the most evil creatures in Doom. Honestly, with Brutal Dilemmas alone, they just do so much damage, it takes away so much help, to be honest. But anyway, as I said, it's all gonna be one-way ticket to hell. Because the point here is for me to finish all this in one shot. Not like reload and save and stuff like that. Because it's just much more interesting if you do it this way. To me, at least. And plus, I'm a veteran gamer and will die at this point now. No, that's not him. I was thinking that was his head, but that wasn't his head. A mini gunner, a evil pinky that dropped a beautiful damage boost weapon of mass destruction. And as you can see, the mini gun isn't the strongest weapon of choice. And yeah, I know. Oh my God! Where are fucking you people coming from? And that's a beautiful Baron. Harkonnen himself, and I actually survived that, didn't I? Oh, mother humping believable. That was scary as hell. Got some rockets, I believe. Thank you very much. I have a rocket launcher for the first ever time, and it's actually more akin to the old school Doom rocket launcher. Awesome. Sexy. This is actually the first time I'm seeing rocket launcher inside the Project Brutality. We have a lot of ammo. What is a secondary fire? Laser guided. <laughs> oh well, this is gonna be fun. Laser. I can barely manage even without one. <laughs> you know, like thank you, laser. Oh, there is that big monstrosity. So I will definitely that that the big spider actually killed me the first time. There. 
So I will take him out with the rocket. Can't open any of these doors if those are doors. To be honest, once I actually hit them like these, in probably that is the regular Brutal Doom version 20, and it exploded on me. And I was like, what the fuck, man? That never happened before. Ever. Like I was I was I I, I was I actually cried after that a little bit. To be honest, when something doesn't go right, you should stop for a five minutes, twenty hours or something like that. I I think I used slug ammo last time and it was like on a distance. I guess definitely a slug ammo is for a much closer combat. Again, this shotgun is most epic fucking weapon of choice. We don't have any other thing, do we? We don't have that is the grenades. Yep, there it is. Oh god, that's a laser, but fuck. Oh my god, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, that's a right click. Okay, didn't know that. And he's dead. Oh my god, I... Uh, I <laughs> too many stuff. You have so many buttons. My god, PC gaming. It's unbelievable thing. So many buttons to utilize, and yet you don't even know how to play a game. Okay, let's get back to the shot. I mean, a shotgun is always my primary weapon of choice. It just is. It's just the best fucking thing ever. But again, you can see we have a minigun, we have a pistol, we have a chainsaw, and that's about it. And we need a little bit of health. We shouldn't forget where we put the... well, where we leave our health points. Why do you do this to demon? Yeah, I always forget which button is for the our UAC machine gun. Which actually the secondary fire is a beautiful sniper rifle. And he was right there. In front of us. You should always take it slow, to be honest. Yeah, especially now with all these mods combined. It's so scary. And health. And health. A little bit of health. No. Oh, I hit the freaking secret. I hit the hit the Wait, let's get inside before it closes. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I don't know what weapon you should use. If it's gonna be a close combat. Uh, it's gonna be scary. Come on. Come on. Come on. Really? Oh, a blue armor. I believe this is the ultimate armor. Uh, let's see. I, I I don't know. A secret has been revealed with beautiful, beautiful sound effect from a, a, a beautiful uh, quake. Isn't that sex? It's pure sex, I say. Oh, there is more, maybe. No. No, good sir, there is no... Okay, so the next time if we do die... Oh, oh what the fuck is this? Oh, so this is how we... No? Yes? Yes? No? Oh, it is. So this is the button which we use. So those are buttons. It doesn't look like a button, to be honest. It's pretty secretive to about that. But still, amazing mod. Love it. Love the, love the campaign itself. It's so detailed. And there is the activation button, which we'll be not utilizing at the very moment. Oh god, I hear something. Oh my god, it's a lot of people! Oh my god! Damn it! That's a lot of people. Let, let's try like this. No, not like that! God damn it. It's a... Oh, damn. You know, like... Thank you. Oh my god, they go through? Like, fuck off! Bitch! <laughs> How do you like them apples? Okay, I'm not, I shouldn't waste everything, but if I... Uh, maybe they're gonna come out of that damnable thing. That's gonna be scary. So let's prepare. Not you. Let's turn that off on alt. And let's... Yeah, yeah let's utilize the slugs. Oh, they're beneath me, that's why. This is an elevator. So that's why. They're gonna just jump on me as soon as I get back there. Ooh, this is gonna be scary. Can we shoot that off? No, we can't. So we're gonna have to have a direct contact with the enemy. I don't know what to use. If I use rocket rocky launcher, it's gonna blow inside my face. But if I use a minigun, it's gonna be very difficult to manage. Again, it's not the most dangerous weapon ever. You need a combat backpack for what? Okay, so there's some other secondary fire for the minigun itself. Oh my god, the leg! Oh my god, the leg! Oh my god, the monsters! 
Come on. Okay, this time we know what to use. Screw this. Ah, I'm dead. Almost. Ah, damn it. Where's the health point? I need my health. Oh my god, I was missing it. Of course, I turned off the flashlight because it's actually the flashlight tends to lag also. Uh, because it's very, like, it's something, of course, that Doom doesn't reality-wise should have. Like, it, it, it tends to eat a lot of memory and processing power. But to be honest, again, I don't really have the beast of a computer to actually play this damnable thing anyway. Ooh, that looks like a secret. With a monster inside. Well, well, oh, that's, oh. That's a, oh, this is a way we can do them. Nice. Oh, I can't open that shit, can I? Wow, that's cool. I didn't notice that. That was fucking awesome. Maybe it wasn't there there before, but now it is. It's cool. You just see that's like a ventilation shaft moving towards the enemy, and we can actually kill off those bastards. Uh, we have our armor. We don't have health. The health is going to be the problem here. Well, we're going to think about something. So let's prepare again the rocket launcher, because that's our main thing. Yeah. Okay, I believe I have probably killed most of the enemy. That lag though, but we survived. We survived with the lag, which is very important. You know, all those imps were actually on the ceiling, like waiting for us, and they were like, "Oh my God, no wonder it lagged!" Like there were so many, one and a bunch of enemies bunched up together, thinking they are cool. Yeah. It, also, what I've noticed is that in Brutal Doom version 20, the explosion as an AoE is very much stronger than in this version 19. What is that? Oh, that's the Skeletor. Oh yeah, the Skeletor. The Rocket Skeletor. Well, we have Rockets. He has Rockets. Who's gonna win? I see you. What the fuck was that? Oh, that was me uh, changing the ammunition. Oh, that's not fair! That's not fair at all. Okay, you wanna play some games? Let's mm, play some games, bitch. He has homing missiles too. Well, color me surprised. I think he's dead, but I'm lying to myself. Yeah. Oh, the, yeah. He can fly also. I forgot about that. He can fly. They can both fly a lot. I have no idea. There. Please tell me that I killed someone. That was just fucking too awesome for a shot. It's not critical. Don't lie to me. Okay, definitely the laser mode is awesome. Like, it helps a mother humping lot. But I don't want to have to get totally too close. Okay, I'm presuming this is a red key card. Oh, really? How did you know? Uh, yeah, I love this. This is just epic to me. This is definitely the attention to detail on the map itself is amazing. Like, oh, an opening. Oh, 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 oh. But first, let's explore what we can in these locations. Oh my God! How the fuck do you people live? Uh, which button? Which button? Oh, fucking alt. God damn it. He's not the only one. Oh, I think I killed two. I think I killed two. Oh my god. They're flying assholes. I don't remember them flying in the original, but there you go. Now they're fly. Fly like an eagle. Oh my god, he's gonna fly a lot. Yeah, that should have happened from the beginning, to be honest. Oh my god, he's still alive? Douchebag. No, no, no. I'm gonna live. You are gonna die. He is a one strong asshole. Oh, no more ammo, really? 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 <gasps> Get a help. Yeah, oh my god, there is, oh my, there is still like a worse thing behind the worst thing. Is that even possible? Oh 
my god, he's following me! Go open the door! Oh, you... <laughs> oh my god! There was a lot of lag, but hell's bells, that's life. Lag actually sometimes helps a lot, to be honest. But anyway, thank you for watching. Next time we might continue. Well, of course we will, but that's gonna take a fucking lot. At least we know where the enemies are, so it's gonna be cool like that. I wish you the very best, as always.